Welcome to 321 Photoshop, I'm Julianne Cost. To avoid having to constantly reset commonly used values for our tools, we can set our preferred options and then save the settings as a tool preset. For example, if I need to crop an image to 1700 by 600 pixels with the delete crop pixels enabled, although I could save the width, height, and resolution as a crop preset, if I want to include the delete crop pixels option, then I should save the settings as a tool preset instead. To do so, I'll click the tool icon and in the tool presets picker, click the plus icon and give the preset a name. Then I'll create the tool preset. Once created, tool presets can be accessed from either the tool preset picker or by using the tool presets panel. Check current tool only to view only the presets for the currently selected tool or leave it unchecked to quickly select other tool presets. Use the flyout menu to select additional options including sort by tool, load and save presets, and access the preset manager. Choose tools and drag and drop to reorder the presets. To use our new tool preset, I'll select it, drag out the crop, and tap enter or return to apply. I also find it helpful to create tool presets for the gradient tool to use in layer masks. I'll use the gradient editor to create a gradient from black to white, give it a name, and create a new gradient. Then I'll select a style, and if needed, I could change the blend mode and opacity. I'll use the Tool Presets panel to save the new tool preset. Again, I'll give it a name, and be sure to include the gradient as part of the preset. Once saved, I can quickly drag the gradient in this Curves Adjustment Layers layer mask to hide the curve in the center of the image. Many other tools, such as the Type and Shape tools, and their settings, can also be saved in the Libraries panel. If you need to share assets and collaborate with others, be sure to check out all that the Libraries panel has to offer. One final Tool Preset tip, right-click on the Tool Preset icon to reset a single tool or all tools to their defaults. I'm Julianne Cost. Thanks for watching.